What can I do for you? Let's have a look. Carry it with pride. We can do a lot with this. New trigger, brand new bolt, your pick. You know what? 
I bet I can make this piece work a lot better for you. Bolts, triggers, parts, back here. Mm-hmm. How about you get some new sights for this, huh? <clears throat> Jacob Worth is a friend of mine. I admire him, but he's just about the worst poker player in all of Valentine. The more bounty posters that go up, the more people flock to my shop. Plenty of reason for that in Valentine. Yours now. Oh, I'm real excited to try this. Appreciate it. Thanks. Look here, you want to catch another center bounty hunter, take a gander at the poster there. Well, it looks like trouble, all right. That one? They say she's sleeping rough near Cumberland Falls. There's more. Want some, huh? Who else? Sure, I'll shoot you. Wouldn't mind some practice. Well, let's get to it then. Go. Look at this. Go. You got this. Just calm down. 
on down, okay? Let's go, boy. That was fucked up. All right. Story. Should we try this? No, he shouldn't have, uh, he got mad because I was shooting on his land after that guy died. Which, I get it, but come on, I just helped you save, I saved his whole farm. Shit. Is this where I killed that son of a bitch? God damn it, it is. Let's go check on him, should we? My temporary horse this way. Pretty sure that's right where I just killed him. No, did I chase him all the way that way? Oh Lord, yeah. No. Okay, so here they are.
not dead. Okay. That's good news. But still, it doesn't make sense. This is two minutes before. <clears throat> this is exactly two minutes before that. We'll see where I was, what I was doing. Dude, because if you help them, it's good for your morale. That poor son of a bitch. Yeah, so what the fuck? Okay. This is weird. Alright, here's the house. Yeah. Alright, here's the shootout. Here we go. God, what a time to save, dude. Yeah, fine, whatever, save it. That one hit him in the face. You just saw how that panned out. Yeah, I killed them all. I'm a great man. Stay out of trouble. I'll try. Mind if I loot their dead bodies? Ooh, I needed that. Sons of bitches. Well, don't feel you have to hang around on my account. Oh, you don't want no company? Fine house you're building here, mister. Fine house. Oops. All right, boy. Checking out your camp. Ooh, he's got a lockbox there. He just said I was too scared. Shouldn't have said that, bitch. And you get a lockbox. Oh, yeah, moonshine, hell yeah. What you got on you, dude? Old one and ring. Yep. <laughs> Mr. Thomas Downs? Yep, that's me. You owe me money. Uh, oh, no, no, I'm, I'm, I'm.
and get this fucker. Will be paid when I can pay it, sir. There's there's nothing more I can say. We ain't a charity, Mr. Downs. Oh, come here, you maggot. Please, sir. I'm I'll Really? Threaten me, would you? Uh, please. I have a family, sir. Please. I don't care about your family. <laughs> I'm working, <laughs> working as hard as I can. If you want the money, you'll have to wait. Why did it have to come to this, huh? Believe me, sir, I didn't want this either. You ain't such a do-gooder, are you? If you're running out on debts... I'm, I'm not running anywhere. I'm... I'm be reasonable. <laughs> you borrowed money from my business partner, Herr Strauss. You owe him, you took the money. He wants it back, what's not to understand? <laughs> Where's our money? I don't have it. Sell your place. We already owe more than it's worth. <coughs> then sell your wife or your family or something. We ain't your idea of charity. Is that clear? <laughs> Thomas! What are you looking at? Thomas! I said what you looking at, woman. My husband isn't well. If we could just have more... Like I said, we ain't nobody's idea of charity. Get us the money. Ah, how did you get on? Not so good. He's almost dead. And they seem more or less destitute. You were a fool for lending them the money. Well, people who aren't desperate don't seem so interested in my propositions. Of course. Miss O'Shea? Well, feels like we are finally getting back on our feet. You, uh, find a buyer for them bonds we stole? Not yet, but Jose is working on it. When we heading west? Soon? I don't know. Feels like things have changed. The whole world's changed. They don't want folk like us no more. We're being hunted. We are smarter than them. Only the feeblest of men take jobs in the government. <laughs> I hope so. Trust Dutch, Mr. Morgan. You have to. They got Micah! Dutch! Arthur! What's going on? They got Micah. He, he's been arrested for murder. He was in Strawberry It's okay, and... son. Breathe. 
They nearly lynched me. They, they got Micah and the sheriffs in Strawberry. And there's talk of hanging them. Here's open. Arthur, what? The fool brought this on himself. You know my feelings about him, Dutch. You think I can't see past his bluster to the heart inside? He is a fine man. No, I ain't saving that fool. I can't go. My face will be all over West Elizabeth. I am asking. He would do it for you. I don't think he would, but fine, all right. Arthur. You okay, Lenny? Yeah, of course I'm okay. You don't seem okay. You take that kid into town. Valentine, not Strawberry. Get him drunk. And Arthur? No crazy business. I've given that up. And you get Micah out of that jail. Come on, son. I'll get to it, Dutch. Just can't drop everything. I rode as fast as I could. Didn't stop for nothing. Yeah, you look like you've been through it. I'm beat. We finally get off that mountain, then this. Mike has got a crazy side on me. What were you boys doing? You were supposed to be scouting ahead for him. I kept asking him what we was doing, but he was, you worry too much, kid. Just, just some business to attend to, kid. You know how he is. Yes, I do. He was half soaked before we even got there. Then we ran into some fellas. One of them, Micah knew, drank some more. And this is supposed to be a dry town we're in, too. And then he shoots one of them. I know how that goes. Couldn't even tell you quite how. It happened like the strike of a match. The law was on us fast, too. They was ready to strangle me up there and then. But I got away, just about. You're all right now. We'll take care of it. So you're gonna go get him? I'll come with you. No, you leave it to me. For now, let's drink some. Forget about Mikey. Oh. It was drank that started all this. Here we are. Just one or two, right, Arthur? Of course, just a drink, no big drama. Can we get a couple beers, please? You, I don't want no trouble. You'll get none from me. I was defending myself. Tommy, he's... He'll be fine. Here, have one for yourself. Thank you. <laughs> mm. Micah seemed to know a lot of people. That was the problem. How you mean? I mean, I done seen a lot of crazy, crazy a stuff, but Mikey... A lot of crazy, crazy stuff. Will you shut up? Will you shut up? Be quiet, buddy. <laughs> oh, they're dullards. My lord. You men is dull. <laughs> <laughs> hey, leave this fool alone. Leave the fool alone. People been leaving me alone for the last ten years. I'm bored. Listen, buddy. You're a charming fellow, one of the best. <laughs> but me and the kid here, well, we're trying to talk business, so could you possibly leave us alone? No offense intended. Ain't no pleasing some folk. Just, just trying to be friendly. <laughs> You know where we went? Afraid I don't know. You know which way my friend went? No idea. Okay. 
Major. Hello, all. You know what? I don't know. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> your mouth, mister. Stop slumping off on me!
alive? Arthur! You, uh, you alive, Arthur? Uh, I want to die. Where are we? What do we do? I don't know. Oh, me neither. Yeah. You pair degenerates. Oh. There's a fine for drunken violence in this town. You're just lucky no one was killed. Hey, we didn't start a thing. <laughs> yes, you did. Well, I don't remember. Either you fools got any money, it's $10 and you're free to walk. Sure. Now, get out of here. I don't want to see either of you around here no more. So, that was a quiet drink? First one was pretty quiet. <laughs> yeah, the first one was pretty quiet. At least it took your mind off a goddamn mic. Well, that's certainly true. I gotta get out of here. I'm just gonna have a little sit down and feel sorry for myself. <sighs> oh. 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 Get out of my way. Welcome back. I need a wash. You got a bath? I got someone warming it up for you already. Just head down the corridor there. Can I get a room for tonight, please? Room's all yours. Head on up. Yeah, Vintage, I got a fire ass pistol. My gun is. Fucking sick. With my express rounds, I just drop people. That's all you need for this whole game, pretty much. But <sighs> Vintage says you need a bath. Me twice. Fifty cents. Oh, sounds good. Yeah. Thanks. Shoot. You can just leave it to me now. <clears throat> I'll be out of your hair in no time. The water's hot enough. Man. Well, I was nearly married once. She never bathed me. Let's just keep that between us and these four walls, shall we? You must get some bad men in here. That's how it goes around here. Ain't often to get a hot bath and a roof over my head. Oh, really? <coughs> I've had quite the run of bad luck recently. Oh, gosh, you poor thing. Yeah. You know, when I think of moving south, think of the weather. <coughs> the house getting fucked up. So, you spoken for? <laughs> You're nosy, aren't you? I think that did something to me. Yeah. All right, that's perfect. Thanks. Oh, she gave me a little kiss on it's my nice head. Nice meeting you. Nice meeting you too, missus. All right. 
Ooh, look at my hair, it looks clean. Hey, fuck. walk right. Hey, fuck you, buddy. I'll blow your goddamn head right off. This will fill me up. I won't need to eat. This will fill me up. Need to buy me a rifle. Long time, boy. I ain't forgotten your brand of trouble. What are you waiting for? Oh, oh shit. Oh, it's so good on this whole receiver. Shackles, I, I just might have it. Oh, 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 yes, yes, perfect. Ah, thank you. Mm -hmm. I, I got no money to give you, but I think I might got something even better. Some of those fellows talked about this old crone up north of Strawberry. Got herself a tidy sum locked away. Ooh, they Maybe just stories, but they were sure excited. Oh yeah. Why'd I be interested in that, huh? Um, I don't know, just a hunch. It's up to you, friend. Oh, Dan is a shitty troll. Yeah. Oh, Dan is a new troll. He thought he was a good troll. But he's not. 
I pegged his mom last night. She screamed, and all his daddy watched. She screamed and moaned so loud as I ran up in that pussy. <laughs> His mom is a real big slut. <laughs> yeah, giddy up, motherfucker. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I love my life. All right. Oh yeah, she's out here. She's wanted alive. Fuck, do I got my uh okay. Then you need to pipe her down. I know where I'm going. She's a man killer, Dan. Oh shit! And sneaking up on. Oh. Oh shit. Oh. Wait. What's wrong with this crazy lady, bro? Where'd she go? Bitch. Don't you ever try and stab me. Goddamn. You are a piece of work. Now, come here. You're done. There's my horse. Make sure she ain't got no weapons on her. This is very Thank God that was a fucking rock there. Ooh, shit. What's that say? I can't read it. Okay, yeah. Pick her up. Alright, get on the horse, lady. Fuck's sake. My horse is not the brightest. Alright, lady. I'm gonna get into town. You got a ride ahead of you. Oh yeah. Oh dear. Look him over me. Is that, did I just do those things? It's a, it's a horrible blur. But I see blood. There's blood everywhere. It won't come out. I'm not like that. I'm a good girl. R really. Oh, she's loony. You believe me, don't you? Don't you, mister? No, I don't. I'm just doing my job, miss. I need help, okay? I, I have an illness. Should I hit her? But a big strong man like you, you'd set me straight. 
Wouldn't you, mister? Oh no, you guys want to record me hitting a woman. So you can use it against me. Oh no. I know better. You guys like, see? You sad sack of shit. Whoa. I wish I'd cut your belly open and show you your guts. Gutless bounty hunting nobody. I hate uh. you. I hate you. I oh. hate you. I hate you. <clears throat> ah! I wish Damn. I'd die. Ah! This bitch is bipolar. This is a broken woman. She just needs to chill. That's a nice view right there coming into town. This game has such good graphics, bro. Just beautiful. Look at this town. Fucking awesome. On the jailhouse. Anything oh, yeah. else you want to try on me? Just get me there. You're no fun at all. I'm afraid I ain't. Try to trick me. You order a lady killer here, Sheriff? <laughs> yeah, we did. Put her in the cell. Holy shit. I protest my innocence. I protest my innocence. She might be a little shaken up. She lost another feller out by the falls. Poor dear. Man, she's got a habit of dying around you, don't they, Mrs. Swan? I hope you'll be comfortable, miss. She'll be fine. Yeah, he dies in the end. We the all know here. it. I don't think anybody don't know it. Vintage might not, but he dies. He sure does. Doesn't John die in the first one, too? The Black Widow herself. This town's so starved of women. I'm sure she could find herself a husband yet. Well, that's cowboys for you. Oh, yeah. Cowboys are dumb. Dumb. Yeah, I mean, everybody knows that Vintage. She does die. Okay, boy. Let's go. There's no way I'm going to finish this without that coming out. It's sad, too. That horse tied up, right? Fuck. Yeah, that's right. It takes place after this, huh? Yeah, you're right. Forgot about that shit. But yeah, like, you could just ride off wherever and just look. I wanted to do, like, an MS... Yeah, like... Look at this shit, bro. They're building a house down there. It's a big game. You got the little town here. Sheeps. Should I rob this guy? Hey, hold up a second, will you? Whoa. Slow it there. This is a robbery. Whoa, we don't need to do this. Come on. Come on. I will kill you right here. All right. Sheesh. Take it. Yeah. Look, I'll just go. See, I'm going. Yeah, go. Damn. 
He had a bell buckle on him. Shit. Waltzing through here like you own the place. Oh, you mother. You didn't say that. I'll be your huckleberry. Look at you. Another coward trying to play it tough. You want me to set you straight, huh? Run along. Mama's expecting you home. You're done here. The dude's a pussy. Oh, that, was boy. that was pussy. What's this bitch got on him? Fuck that motherfucker. This is a damn O'Driscoll. Am I supposed to pay him first? Oh, here he is. Can I give you a ride somewhere? Yeah. Can I get a ride, please, partner? Where to, friend? Uh, let's Can go to the ranch. To Emerald Ranch, please. Damn, four fifty. That's so close. We'll be there before we leave. Oh Christ! I just wasted four dollars and fifty cents. So I'm Let's get it, boss! This is when I wish I was born, folks. On the west, on the prairie, where men were built hard and tough. None of this fucking bitch shit. Is this my stop, mister? Well, here we are. All right. Too either. Oh. all right, all right. What do we got here? Came all this damn way. I uh, don't know how to play dominoes or I'd whoop that dude's ass right now. There and welcome. Hey, what's up? I don't want nothing from you, bro. Good day to you. Is that the only place this asshole could take me? Fucking bitch. I had to rob him. Move to Alaska, homie? Yeah, I want to. I lived off the land, bro. I've lived in the woods in a little cabin. I'll show you what size when I find one. Let me find one. I'll find one. We'll go free roaming. I'm 300 acres, man. For eight months. Would have been too tough in the winter. We have pretty hard winters. Smaller than this. I lived in something smaller than this. Way smaller. Like missing that whole backside. Should we see what it is? Oh shit! Oh! What the fuck? What was that all about, bro? Got guts all over me? I fucking blew that guy's brains out, bro. Alright. <clears throat> 
<clears throat> brought this on yourself, bitch. Okay, so yeah, you'd walk in the cabin. Uh, walk in the cabin. There'd be like a sink and shit over here. This is about as big as it, it was right here. There'd be like a sink and shit over there. Table in the middle. Yeah. No rooms. Look at this place. He says, you brought this on yourself. Fucking dickhead. And why can't I grab this right here? It's like hair, hair gel. Won't let me take it. You brought this on yourself! Fucking pistol whipped him and blew his brains out. Dumbass, bro. That's locked? That's strange. This is a robbery, folks. I'm not proud of it, but... Man's got to do what a man's got to do. Not proud of it. We did get a little card out of the deal here. What's this? No, we're not sleeping. There's my horse out the window. How do I pick this up? Shit. Which button? Tell me. Examine. Okay. When you guys are talking, I can't see. Thorns. So I think Arthur got sick from that guy that coughed in his face. Do you guys remember that? I just robbed a guy. Um, which one we call it? Uh, vintage. That guy that coughed in my face and she said he wasn't well. Do you remember that? Yeah. He could have got it from him. Because he gets something bad, man. He dies. But when does he get it? You know? He could have got it right... Oh, look at this guy pulling up. Oh. Fuck is he doing? What, did you see him cough in his face? But yeah, what I stayed in was about that size. Nothing fancy for sure. That's way fancier. Hate doing it, folks, but you started with me. I was just trying to... I was just trying to check out their shack, that's all. Poor dog. Poor dog's gonna starve now. and kids
get the fuck out of here, dude. Am I, is this some kind of sick joke? No, get out of here. Let's roll. Always increasing that dead eye time. I guess if you free those guys, you get dead eye time. Yeah, he coughed blood in his face. Is that where he gets it? Is it TB? I ain't gonna mess with the black man. AD loves the brothers. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. I'm going the wrong way. Hunting the rare animals? Yeah, for sure. Which town is this? Out of the way. Yeah, no shit. Oh, this is Valentine again? Well, fucking, I don't need nothing from here. Horse is tired. All right, we need a map, dude. We're lost. We're lost. Hosea Matthews. Gonna turn around and go like yep. there. Yeah, these are high velocity rounds. And my new pistol. This thing rips. This will kill a man in one hit. Shoot him twice, he's dead. Unless he's just a tough son of a bitch. We're letting the horsey recover a little bit. And, uh. I don't. Oh, shit, wrong way. I don't, I think this is one of the best games ever made, quite frankly. I've ever played. Get fucking owned. <coughs> I told you. 
It's all about the pistol. I shot the fuck out of the two guys on the wagon. Got one ran way the fuck off here. So yeah, these are the Adriscoll's vintage. Dutch, they're like the gang against our gang. They're Irish and they are fucking cocksuckers. Every last one of them is a dickhead. And I believe they killed Dutch's wife. You should be able to see see how he's got green on. Fucking dickhead. Get going. Move that cart. Pick up this ammo. Alright, let's go. Yeah, they tried to ambush me. That's why I ride with my gun out. Idiot. You know, that's how I ride with my... I heard something, so I... Didn't have to drop. Who's there? Oh, he scared me. Oh, shit, I'm hitting tree. Yeah. You can ride with your gun out, it don't matter. I should let my horse rest, I never do. Oh, always chores to be done. Later, chores to be done. We got fucking lazy bastards around here. People are lazy cocksuckers, that's why. Good morning, Arthur. Morning, Mr. Morgan. Go fuck yourself. Uh, yeah, I just upgrade one gun. The volcano pistol just rips through people. Good morning, Arthur. Good morning, miss, uh... Oh, damn, sorry. Good morning. What the fuck, bitch? I'm gonna punch this. Sorry, I don't hit women. Bad look, AD, bad look. All right. Nope, no chores. Sweet, bud. Got shit to do, bro. I'm a hard ass fucking worker, dude. Hey, what up, Dead Progressive? Hey, DP, go check out Fusions Live. 
Killed a pretty fire alive. Yeah, I hope your Easter was good, bro. Just making some progress and some red dead, that's all. Yeah, I think. No, I gotta pick these up. Gotta feed the horses. beat it like twice I just bought it again I had it uh, and then it I don't know my daughter was playing with the game but I bought a ps5 anyway so and it doesn't take discs so I, I had to buy a lot of games again I just got the digital version you know so I plan on buying everything digital from now on. Thank you, Mr. Williams. Yeah, I should. We should get down some time on something. That'd be fun. I thanked you already. Was it not loud enough? Damn, you have 700 games. You're like, uh, what's his name? Cortex. Huh. You're probably real good at games then. I'm not that good, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you. I've never really been that good at games, but I still try hard. Yeah, it's a pretty innocent hobby, really. Um, can't get in a whole lot of trouble gaming. Oh, wait, where am I? I'm going the wrong way with this barrel. Or with this uh, FF7. What's that, a racing game? Here you go, horsey. Oh, they do. They do. I'm a good man. I'm a hard-working man. Look at me go. I always doing a kind deed where I can. I will rob and shoot a motherfucker, though. Oh, Final Fantasy. Yeah, I've never played one of those games. I've never really had time to play, to be honest with you. Till now. Shit, I could play every day till I'm dead. All day, every day. DP. That's what I, maybe I'll do. That's maybe what I'll do. I enjoy it. I'm having a lot of fun. Of course. Let's go. Where are we heading? A lot of fun. This is good. There's so many good goddamn games out there too. Been a rough couple of weeks. You need anything? I don't think so. I got all I need. Let's go then. So you still ain't replaced Bodicea? Ah, oh, I miss her. She was quite a horse. This one's okay, but ain't no Bodicea. I've been meaning to offload this big Shire horse for a while now, unruly bastard. Where'd you get him? Some big, loudmouth bastard tried to rob me and was out riding, so I... Well, you know how it is. I see. Let's take him to Valentine. It's on the way. Sort of. There's a decent dealer there. We'll unload him. You could buy yourself a new horse. Put your saddle on them. Let's get going. Okay. But well, I do kind of like this horse. There's nothing wrong with two horses. And the stables always have the best ones. Well, I guess you're right. This is going to be fun, Arthur. You won't throw me? No, he's an angel. If I'm near him. Nasty little look in his eyes. Oh, don't be rude about this magnificent creature. Put your saddle on him and let's go. 
Let's get this on right, boy. Okay, see if you can get your leg over that brute. Easy, big fella. All right, let's head into town. And maybe stay out of the saloon this time. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. We're heading out. Might be gone a couple of days. They got a good range of horse tack at the Valentine stables. Some beautiful saddles. I used to have a real nice one. Yeah, what happened to that? Got stolen outside that saloon in Deer Creek. Ah, uh, I remember now. Just about. <laughs> that turned into a long day. Yes. Remember? Mac went crazy, threatened to kill the whole town. And Davy was passed out so cold we left him there, came back in the next day, and he woke up, started right back drinking again. <laughs> Bro, I don't remember if I did get ass fucked by them. She had some spot, that girl. It must be pretty hard on Lenny. You could tell he was sweet on her. Well, Lenny and Jenny could never have worked. That's like Arthur and Martha, or Bill. I mean, that's my worst fear: surprise butt sex. Yeah, maybe you're right. Just feel a bit like our luck died with them too. Nonsense. We'll be all right. Just need some money to get back on our feet. I hope so. You found a way to offload those Cornwall bonds yet? Not yet. They're still very hot. Need to be done right. I have a couple of leads I'm looking into. <laughs> Don't let that big bastard get the better of you there, Arthur. Hey, he's all right. are just up ahead. Yeah. Well, all right. Go sell that big brute. Buy yourself a horse. Okay. Right. I'm going off to the general store. Get a few things to lure that bear out with. Meet you back here in a bit. Hey. How can I help you? I'm in the market for a new horse. Something strong and fast. Well, you're in the right place. I got some beauties in at the moment. Yeah. yeah what about this one here? Yeah, you looking to sell? I show you. You got papers? No. No papers. Well, of course, that's going to affect what I can pay. But your luck's in. I got a fella who's been looking for a decent workhorse like this for a while. He'll pay a good price. Otherwise, I can always stable them here for you. Here, take a look.
partner. You got yourself a deal. And a fine new horse. I hope so. Well, I don't sell anything other than good animals. You have my word on that. Here are your papers. And on me, a new grooming brush. And some treats. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yeah. All right, you. You treat this fella well. I know he's gonna look after you just fine. Interesting choice. How much did you pay for that thing? Not that much. Okay, well... With some good care, you should be able to make something of it. Okay, boy. All right, let's get going. We got quite a ride ahead of us. Lead the way. So, what's this lake we're heading for? It's called O'Cray's Run, up in the mountains east of Cumberland Falls. I just hope I can remember how to get there. Back into the mountains? I sure didn't figure on that. But this time, we're doing the chasing. So how are things with you and John? Fine. Ain't it about time you let it go now? It was a year, Jose. He ditched us for a goddamn year. I've spoken to him many times. He knows he did wrong. He just wants to put it behind him. I'm sure he does. Running off on that kid is one thing, but there's a code. He knows that. He ain't Trelawney. Dutch and you pretty much raised him. I know. But it's done. Has been for a while now. <sighs> Nobody else would have been welcomed back that easy after that long. And you know it. Maybe. But please don't you put that to the test. I got an electrician coming out tomorrow. We we'll take out thermometers, all okay. that stuff. I think we need to head right up here. Yes, I remember this place. <clears throat> Moonstone Pond. Yeah, I keep We're having to. Spend money. A lot of money, too. <sighs> oh, you do? Oh, yeah, you need to get down in the basement. Just grab your phone and go in the basement and watch the weather. Hey, what up, Pitbulls? Your buddy Martin rage quit, Pitbulls. Pretty dangerous going anywhere near Blackwater. Right, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Of course. Look there. Rabbits. Maybe we should catch one to cook. Sure. Try and shoot one. You don't want to use anything too powerful on a small animal like that. Just ruin the meat. Best thing's a bow or a 22 caliber varmint rifle. I have hunted rabbits before, you know. Yes. In a obliterated them with a shotgun, if I remember right. Yeah, he lost it. Pretty sad. He's got a lot of stress on his plate. He's on probation. I mean, that whole neighbor thing, my wife said. She, she said there's no way that's all it is. She goes, you don't go to jail for pulling a wire.
she goes, there's more to that story. Oh, shit. Yeah, because she goes, think about it. If you pulled our neighbor's wire, you wouldn't go to jail. She goes, he must have been beefing with his neighbor and they just pressed charges. For damaging property and shit. They've dealt with him before. Now then, you get a set up. Uh... Yeah, there's no way. Think about it, Vintage. If you saw a wire and pulled it and it pulled out of your neighbors, there's no way. You know, there's no way. I tried to tell them to chill. And... They're delicious on an open fire like this. He's just a mess. He's got a lot to learn about life. Oh, he's fine. Get in this late. Okay. <laughs> After all that. Yeah, I just don't see it working between him and that lady with five kids. And I think he's moving too fast. And I think he's making mistakes. And I would say that to anybody. And he couldn't handle that. Other people were doing way worse shit. I wasn't. I was just like, bro, you're fucking... You're gonna fuck your whole life up even worse. And he will. He'll end up leaving her. And then what? Where is he going to go? What's he going to do? Nothing. <sighs> Goes to court the ninth For what? He said he already paid the 900 Which I don't get where he got that money, but it is what it is. They are going to violate him because he, I bet. I could find out. Should I find out? Should I get his paperwork? I'll call PBR and have him go do it. Yeah, I don't think he did. And like my wife said, um, yeah, I don't know. He just, the guy's got fucking issues. Like he preaches the Bible all day, but I ain't saying I'm perfect, bro. Not by a long shot, but he's really going to go like to jail. Somebody said that, too. I don't think it was my wife, because she knows about old Marty Mar. All right. Well, we better get some rest. I want to be up at first light to find this monster. 
Well, if he's violated, when he goes to court, they're going to let him know, obviously. He better be worth all this drama. I don't know. Morning, Arthur. You ready? Well, oh, give me a minute. Coffee? Sure. There you go. So, what's your plan? Well, we'll see if we can track him, but we might need to lay bait to draw him out. Bears like fish, obviously, but they also have a... Yeah, he's too. desperate. A lot of fellas... Oh, fuck, when you think 200 bucks is a lot of money. I prefer to hunt on the ground. More dangerous. But we'll have a much better chance of getting good shot. In. And if he bolts, we can start right off after him. Can you mix up this bait for me while I finish packing this up? Fish, berries. Tie it up in I've been telling people 100 bucks ain't quite what it I used to be. I what you're talking about. I grew up in the mountains, Arthur. I was virtually weaned on bear meat. How are you getting on with that? Now's the time to look for deals on shit. Really watch your money. <coughs> okay. I think I got this done. Good. Pack up and we'll get going. Pack up, Arthur. Alright, shut the fuck up, Hosea, you dickhead. Okay. Let's go. A little ass fifteen dollar horse. Don't make fun of my fifteen dollar horse. By the water. That's where I saw him last. Okay. How's that horse treating you? Good. Oh, so good. He's you a good know, horse. I was in this area with Bessie years ago. Really? I didn't know that. I imagine you still miss her. Every day. Did you two ever think about getting out of the lot? Uh, we did briefly. You don't remember? Guess you were still young. Didn't last long. I drifted back into it. She understood. She knew what I was. I remember you not being around for a while, but well, things were looser back then. Truth is, <laughs> there's never really any getting out. And staying in, it's hard. People have been crazy lately. Missy and I made it work. I swear to Why? God, you dude. About getting out? Me? No, of course not. Listen, That's really good, Pitbull. If Dutch's grand plans work, and we can make enough money to go someplace new. Yeah, I won. I won five hundred on a five hundred on a five dollar. Anyway, for now, it was like a hunting I one. A bear, so dude, and the thing is, I knew I was gonna win. By the water here, see if he's been fishing again. Recently. I knew I was gonna win. I just felt it, and I did. Won 500 big ones. I was real excited. It was like big bucks or something. I say, hot dog. I was on the phone with somebody. Oh, where is his ass? Right here, bro. Big Powerball. That'd be fun to win, huh? That'd be fun. Just be richer than a son of a gun. That is a lot of money. I'd just give it all to the poor people. I wouldn't give a fuck. I'd give 899 million away. Swear to God I would. They'd be like, AD, how are you poor already? Like you have less money than you did before. What does he want me to do? Well, there's some paw marks here, Jose. They sure look big enough. Oh yeah, what is uh, that? Let's hope it's him. Can you tell which way he went? Oh yeah, he went this way, Jose. Look at this big son of a bitch. Tracks, go into those 
big son of a bitch. Hey, I don't think he went that way. Shut up, Hosea. Hey, Have been left by our friend, I reckon. Come on, see if there's anything else. on the ground just here there she is here watch your step looks real fresh reckon he's got to be close let's keep going Damn it. looks like the trail ends here we lost him for now uh, a little optimism Arthur <sighs> well what do you think? I think we split up in each look. Either that or we could place bait here. That could work. Which do you think? Let's split up. Okay. I'll head this way. You head down that track. You're fine, old man. Of course I'm fine. It's, it's nothing. Ugh. Nothing at all. <laughs> Thank you. I think. <laughs> that was fun. <sighs> you know what, Arthur Morgan? I'm a little old and beaten up to be after the biggest game. You can have this. What is it? It's a map. A man in a bar gave it to me. Well, I stole it from him, but that's another story. <laughs> He said it, it told him where to find some real big animals. Thank you. It's a pleasure. You saved my life, Arthur. <laughs> I think I'm going back to camp to lick my wounds. <laughs> you coming or you gonna track that monster? Well, you... I'm coming with you. <laughs> Let's get going then. Let's see if Dutch gives us any crap about disappearing like that. I don't need another. We gotta be out there making money speech. We were just out scoping a lead. 
He doesn't need to know it was a big furry one. Well, thanks, Arthur. I probably owe you one. Don't worry about it. I need to head out to Emerald Ranch soon, look into something. See you later. Always chores to do, folks. That hay goes in one end and comes out the other. How's it going? You're in line, missus. Oh, Susanna, won't you cry for me? With the bum 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 bum. Little Jackie. Oh, look at the rainbow. I ain't no kind of father. I wish the boy no harm, but well, you know how we live. We live free. Yeah, Becky, this is when living was simple and hard all at the same time. Yes, ma'am. I am. You had to do your chores back then, Becky, and pull your weight. And to answer your question, I couldn't finish reading it because I can only see like a small portion on my screen. I think you asked about the game. Oh, this fucking idiot. It's cologne. It's liquor. It's cologne from cologne. These guys are thieves. You grew up on a farm? Hell yeah. I just had a few nips, Arthur. I'm not drunk. I'm just happy. Yeah. A lot of work to be done on a farm, I bet. I've never worked on a farm. Fresh air, no cell phones. Yeah. Yeah, simple living, man. Just God's country. Like, look at this view. Dude, they picked the best place to camp. You know, nowadays, you ain't going to find nothing pristine anymore. Like, even in this view, if you were to look from one end to the other, you, in today, to 2024... You'd see all sorts of fucking modern shit. That's what's sad. Like telephone poles and... No matter where you go, it seems... You gotta go, like, outside of U.S. To get real pristine looking still nature. Some, like, cheaper countries. Won't you cry for me? Ba -ba 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 -ba. But yeah, we're just trying to get our money out of Blackwater. We're a gang. We rob, steal, kill. Uh, we loan shark. We don't do no hookering. The ladies pretend to hooker and then they rob the men. I mean, I don't know what the ladies do. I, mean, I don't know if it'd be cool to grow up on a farm or not. It'd be like the sense of hard work and, and, and progress and that's got to be rewarding. Building up your homestead, whatever the case may be. Like I said, now everything's so expensive, it's just insane. Mr. Morgan. Mr. Morgan. Wait, she always chasing me around. The girl saw that friend of yours, Mary Gillis. 
sniffing about. Mary? Yes. I never liked that woman, Mr. Morgan. Funny business. <laughs> She's a gossip hound, that lady. She's always talking shit about somebody. You know, I swear to God. She's the boss, though, of the ladies. What? He was always special to me. All these years. All these things we've done. Good thing. Bad thing. All these people we've seen passed on. You was always special. Oh, Dutch. We living or dying this time, Dutch. I guess we'll find out soon enough. Yeah, and that's the leader. He's the gang leader. I feel like I'm second in command, but I'm not quite sure. What's this here? It's like a song or something. Fucking. No. There's something going on. No, no, no. Oh, no, I don't care about that right now. Dear Arthur, I've written this letter a hundred times or more, and I cannot oh. it write. It's me. You know it's me from the bad handwriting. I know I said when we last spoke, and I was going off to get married, that we would not speak again. I know I said a lot of things, and I meant them, I suppose, at the time. But I'm not so proud as to not speak to people who care for me, or cared for me. I've been in Valentine for a couple of months. I had some bad luck and, well, it's a long story and not an interesting one, but I am here for now. I saw a couple of the girls or whatever the polite term is for them that ran with you and your associates Hose. in town. And I heard tell of a man who sounded like you. I would love to see you again. If you could spare me a little bit of your time, I'm renting a room <clears throat> at Chadwick Farm, just north of Valentine. Mm -hmm. Yours, Mary Linton. That's she's always using me. I let her use me though. <sighs> nah, no, no good pranks. I'm not a real big prankster. Too much. That fucking whistling. Oh, they're fighting. Hey, Arthur, what you want? Man, you one sour son of a bitch, ain't you? Only when I see you. Only when I see you. Good Jesus. The Wild West is here. Well, howdy, mister. Let me sleep. Six hours. And here we are. I can't believe all them storms. Everybody's getting blown over. This is horrible. Is this evening? Oh yeah, Becky. 
It's always something, Becca, Becca. Always something, ain't it? Oh, what the fuck is Dutch? Is this Dutch or who is this? No, it's the Indian. No, it's John. What's up, man? How you feel? Stronger, for sure. But not strong enough to work. <laughs> you tell him, man. I mean, he did get fucked up. Look at how pretty this is, y'all. This is God's country. It's crazy how video games have come so far. He's always fighting with his old lady up there. Because he don't want to be a dad. He's like Martin. He, oh. He's like Martin. He don't want to be a dad. What's this say? Oh, I could sit down right here? Word. I can sit and watch the sun go down, man. Damn. And smoke one. Damn, dude. This game is so cool, man. Oh, fuck. Got a bunch of shit I gotta do tomorrow. My wife gave me a bunch of Russell Stover's chocolates. Right here, man. Got a big old box of them. I wonder what's on the back it says what's in them. I should put on the inside of the cover. Okay, so this one is milk chocolate strawberry cream, milk chocolate peanuts, milk chocolate caramel. Okay, but a lot of dark chocolate, which I won't eat. Oh, for wreck? Yeah, that's cool. Hopefully y'all pass it. We got it here. It really brings down the price for my family. Because I'm a family man. And it brings down the price for everybody around me. When it becomes recreational. Ugh. So, you can keep up to two pounds. They don't hassle you. It's, you ain't gotta, like, if you go on the Facebook marketplace, there's weed everywhere. There's weed everywhere for sale. Everywhere. That's how I was laughing, like, when Square was like, oh, the FBI is going to kick in your door. I'm like, yeah. Well, they could start by going on Facebook and just start doing busts. But they, they would fill their jails up in one day, dude, with a bunch of shit that's legal. It binds their hands. When they make it recreational, it binds their hands. What, I ain't telling your son to slang or nothing, but once they make it recreational, yeah, he should sell it. Fucking make money, they ain't gonna do shit. They ain't gonna do shit. They don't care, dude. There's, there's thousands of people that just start selling it once it becomes recreational. I mean, thousands. They, there's no fucking way they would fill up all the jails and then, like, go in front of the judge. They're just like, well, it's legal. So what, you saw hand-to-hand? -hand? Like, how did you figure this out? It doesn't make sense. I want it federally legal so we can mail it. You know? It'd bring down the price for everybody. 
marijuana wouldn't be a big deal anymore. Fucking. It is a gateway drug, though. Kind of. I guess you could say that. I'm thinking about ho shoestring hobo Larry. Or whatever his name is. Shoestring hobo lost. Dang, I hope he's okay. Maybe the stock will go up. Well, yeah, that's... I lost a bunch of money day trading, but I was trading day uh, weed stocks and I was doing okay. And I got, what happened is I got stuck in a trade overnight and I lost just like in the next day, I lost just thousands in like a matter of 24 hours. And I just was like, what the fuck? And it pissed me off so bad because I wanted to trade and I couldn't. I couldn't. I was like locked in for some reason. I was mad. Oh, never been so mad in my life. <clears throat> but that's for the birds. That shit's too stressful. It's like gambling. I'd rather just slowly save money and make what I make and think towards the future. And the future is I'm going to do what I want to do, whatever it is. I've just put myself in that position in life, and I'm in that position. I can do whatever the fuck I want. So that's what I'm, I mean, within reason. You know, I'm not, I'm not some rich asshole. I'm poor, Miss AD's got all the money. She don't let me touch no money. Miss A.D. got a pretty good raise. She got a dollar raise, so she's making pretty good money now. <laughs> Which is cool. She got a dollar raise. She's a hard-working lady, man. I don't know, part of me thinks, you know, could I go live in another country? I could find a country with a view like this and just live out there. But God. Do you guys think America is like, has anybody traveled? I just be thinking I want to travel. Like, I just want to move my whole family to, like, Argentina. Germany legalized it? Holy shit. That's crazy. Who my father loved, in a way. But his brother, whom my father hated with an almighty passion. He, he, he'd beat the slaves almost nightly. Whip them. Rape them. Whoa! One night, my father was getting a whooping for the crime of being born. But his I'll be right back. When his sister-in-law, the, the master's wife, walks in. Now, fearing for my father's life, she told her brother-in-law to stop. Well, not only did he not stop, he beat her too. Next day, his brother, the master, shot him dead. The whole plantation cheered. The master gave my father his dead brother's watch and told him as he did so, time will catch up with us all. A year later, he set them free and hanged himself the very next night. My father gave me that watch. Beautiful, big pocket watch it was. And now, I 
I've gone and lost it fleeing Blackwater. When I get some spare money, I'm gonna buy myself another one to honor both my father and them folks that saved his life. All right, I'm going to fire up a regular live. I'll be back. 